told Julie, we're not far from where we were, okay, yeah. but we're going to do some core work. Yes. You've got a weapon. Yeah, this is my ab roller. Uh, this is my favorite exercise. It works your core and your abs. I do this probably every time I do abs, which is twice a week. Awesome. So let me show you what we're going to do. So this is the starting position. It's kind of like that cat-cow that you do in yoga. You're going to start with a cat. What you do is you extend all the way, get that stretch, curl your stomach back. Okay, it's just a curling motion. Stop right here because anything else after this, you're gonna be using your hip flexors to cheat. And we are not cheaters. Talk to me about um, variations, people with back issues. You look like you also are using your arms, so you have to have some upper body strength as well. Yes, yes. So um, as long as back issues, I don't suggest doing this because it does put a lot of strain on your back. Um, another alternative to this is doing it on a yoga ball. This is going to be for more for beginners and people with back problems. So same setup. We're going to keep the back curled. Hands on the ball. Extend. Okay, now you're not going all the way down like the ab roller, which is going to protect your back a little bit more. But this is the great way to start. A couple of variations that you can also do is you can go off to the side. That hits the obliques. And with this exercise, always keep your back curled because anything that has to do with curling is going to be with your abs. Appreciate it.